good evening, everyone. We'll also be taking a look at your forecast. The low moves in tonight. It'll be gray and cold tomorrow. And yes, we are going to see scattered showers over the weekend. The details coming up. We'll also be taking you out towards the West San Fernando Valley because there is a brand new accident along the Ventura Freeway. We'll be talking about that as well moves in and the cold front that's with it. So uh, tomorrow, yes, temperatures are going to drop. We're going to see the conditions get gray and uh, a little bit icky if you don't like it gray. Um, let's go ahead and take a look. At and I'm Vera Jimenez and we'll also be taking a look at your forecast as we look over downtown Los Angeles. That cold front is moving in. So are the clouds, the rain and the winds. I'll have the details coming up. And in five live traffic, brand new accident heading into East LA along the 60. I'll have those details coming up. Yep, yep, yep. Yep, I agree. All right, let's go ahead and take a live look over Hollywood. And this is exactly what Micah was talking about. It is already foggy outside. The marine layer is moving in. And as you can see on our microcast, it's not just going to invade the coastal plain, but it's also going to move into the Inland Empire and into our valleys as well. Tomorrow afternoon, we will see a little bit of clearing, and that's around 1.30ish. But take a look at how fast those clouds are going to redevelop as that front moves into the region. Uh, tomorrow, though, going to be cold. The temperatures are going to be mostly in the low 60s. We are also going to see some strong onshore flow and that's going to produce strong winds along our passes and canyons. And of course, it's also going to be a little bit wet. I'll tell you when the rain is going to get here and how much coming up in just a little bit. Guys, back to you for now.